The themes of love are often played on during many visual novels, where romance is a given and the main protagonist gets most of it. This is not true for the overdrive developed visual novel Bakuten Why I Became an Angel, where love only brings unexpected consequences. The game takes a realistic approach to storytelling as actions have heavy consequences on the people's lives. This emotional roller coaster requires the player to not only be on board with the idea of bad endings, but also find interest in many tales of love that the story contains. Bakuten Why I Became an Angel introduces the main protagonist, Tomoe, who, for one reason or another, doesn't believe in love. Now, throughout the story, he explains his reasonings, and I can personally relate to many of his feelings. The truth is that this is a world where angels exist or so people say. One day while practicing archery, he ends up shooting down an angel named Anye. The crash breaks her instrument of love, which takes the form of a guitar, now with only one string. Tomoe doesn't want anything to do with the angel, and for good reason. If angels exist, why is there so much unhappiness in the world? He struggles to make sense of the fact that sadness and loss is something that people struggle with daily and how he personally has gone through it. In order to get the angel out of his life, he ends up helping her to motivate others in his town to find love. With every romance comes a new string. However, not all is what it seems and Bakutin ends up showing its true colors by its conclusion. Each chapter you'll have to make a choice whether to interfere in a relationship or not. Sometimes interfering can have a huge consequence. I was often left in shock at the outcome of these decisions and the emotional impact that they had on me as the player. The developers created a way to make each choice more impactful by having the player take on the role of the supporting character who is currently at a romantic crossroad. It's extremely unique and often leads to some interesting realizations about their motives and true feelings that you wouldn't be able to understand otherwise. Throughout the 30 hour story, the cast of characters grows rather large, which makes things a little messy if you don't care about a particular character's dilemma. Also, by the end of the sixth chapter, all hope for a happy ending is lost as you find yourself feeling more and more like Tomoe. The idea of love is extremely difficult to convey in a real sense, where most visual novels crank up the fantastical side of things to make reunions unrealistic yet happy, Bakuten seems to take the same approach but show you the reality of it all and the effect that it has on each person involved, both good and bad. By the end, not everyone can be pleased, which puts Anya's abilities and Tomoe's philosophy as a main selling point for the conclusion. The issue in the game is that there's too many characters to keep track of. Each chapter introduces a new set of students and and somehow connects them to Tomoe. In the event that you don't particularly like the couple that a chapter is focusing on, well that doesn't matter because you're stuck with it. Not every vessel for the story is as capable as Tomoe, which makes some characters just come off as a little annoying with how they end up dealing with their feelings. The character illustrations are brilliant in this title, as each character in this large cast stands out. Each chapter allowed me to understand the character's resolve and the consequence of my decision whether I interfered or not. Voiced audio is a huge plus for Bakuten. Each character has a range of emotions and it all works out well. Sadly, Tomoe is not voiced, which ends up hurting moments of the story where you're seeing things play out from a different perspective and you happen to talk to him. I felt that having him voiced would have easily made some of the more preachy rants from him more impactful. Bakuten Why Became an Angel is a visual novel that is made to leave you struggling. It's true that you can't please everyone, and yet I couldn't help but try. I'm so conditioned from this genre to expect there is going to be a true ending where everyone is happy and you have some harem orgy. That is not the case here, and I'm only left with the true consequences of love. I recommend Bakuten, even with the broken heart that it left me with. It's a visual novel that tries new things with its storytelling, as I was forced to be the cause of some lovely romance that often had some troubling side effects. And if you're only here for the Urage, well, there's plenty of that, but it definitely takes a back seat compared to the story elements. Noisy Pixels giving Bakuten why I became an angel an 8.5 out of 10. Thank you for watching. Please read the full review at noisypixel.net. Noisy Pixels is run by a group of gamers who work hard to deliver news, reviews, previews, and more. Please subscribe to keep up with all our future content.